or the most beautiful way. Hey everybody, it's Lou. On my honeymoon, I was in Venice and we were walking around the city and looking for the old uh, location of the old opera house. And we asked this uh, old woman uh, how to get there. And she said to us something I you never hear in the United States, certainly not in New York. She said, well, you, you look like you're an American. So do you want the fastest way or do you want the most beautiful way? And I've always remembered that because the most beautiful way, of course, right? Um, those, those memories came back to me when I was doing my site visit at Coral Gables, Florida. Coral Gables is one of our top seven cities this year. And um, their nickname is the City Beautiful. And those three words really describe that city almost instantly. It's what you see and what you get uh, in Coral Gables, which is uh, located about 11 kilometers southwest of Miami. It perceives itself as a Mediterranean city down there on the south coast of Florida. And architecturally, it really is. It's also a planned city built in 1924-25 uh, along a European model. And uh, it is absolutely spectacular. The public pool is actually a Venetian pool. They have streets named Seville and named after European cities. But their technology will blow you away. Their utility poles are AI poles, these black AI poles. You can see a picture of them. And they are so structured for sustainability with regard to their infrastructure that what they've done is managed to balance this beautiful city, city beautiful, with this robust technology infrastructure, the IT. They have a smart city hub. They have a digital twin, which monitors the maintenance of 44,000 trees. I mean, they have an enormous amount of trees. A spectacular beauty maintained by technology, a real good combination of beauty and brains, so to speak. So uh, when you start checking out our top seven or when you come to New York uh, in October, check out Coral Gables and ask them about the Venetian pool because it's really beautiful.